we finish the rest of the video, make sure you subscribe or else. All right. So after Pauline Malinaji's second loss in a row by KO against Danny Garcia, um, Pauli, the Magic Man Malinaji, he's 33-7 and seven with 7 KO. And, you know, he kind of missed that he'll never fight again. Um, like I said, it's his second loss. He got brutally knocked out by Sean Porter last time. The referee stopped this one. But, you know, they want to know what do you think about fighting again. He said, mm, probably not. You know, he's like, you hate to make an emotional decision. You know, my career started in Brooklyn 14 years ago. But if it ends in Brooklyn tonight, at least I ended it at home in front of my fans. The best fans in the world. I was happy to do it in front of you guys. And I'm sorry, you know, I didn't get the win. But listen, I lost into a great champion tonight. And, you know, well, you know, they want to know, well, what did you think about, you know, Arthur McCanty? You know, did he did he stop it too early? And, you know, what did you think about that? And he said, I, I don't have no problem with the referee stoppage. And, you know, Paulie admits that he wasn't really able to change up the pace of the fight. And, uh, you know, he ba basically admitted that Danny Garcia was breaking him down in the second half of the fight. Uh, you know, basically he's... Basically saying, listen, in the future, I really just want to concentrate on, on my commentating career. And listen, Paulie's a good commentator. Uh, I like him better than 70, 80 percent of the guys that's commentating right now. Um, he gets paid. It's consistent. He doesn't have to train, doesn't have to take a beat down. And it's a steady paycheck. You know, Paulie's made a few million in his career. So, you know, right off into the sunset with this last little bit, pay off the last little bit of the bills and. Keep that steady income coming, commentating. Listen, you got a lot of fans out there. You, you've been great for the support. Excuse me, for the sport. So, listen, leave your thoughts and comments below. Should Pauli Malinaji keep fighting? Or should he hang up the gloves and focus full-time on commentating? I'm interested to see what you got to say. Leave your comments and thoughts below.